Good morning. <laughs> that sleepy voice. Good morning. Good morning. Morning. All right, so Elise just made me some breakfast. I kind of helped a little bit. I put the cheese on. Uh, what else did I do? I put on the everything bagel seasoning. Yeah, and I needed to get out of my kitchen. And, but I needed to get out of the kitchen. There are too many, too many cooks in the kitchen. Apparently, one more cook is too many. So, uh, But I had a delicious egg and Canadian bacon spinach wrap. And I'm going to roll that footage for you right now. Check it out. So I'm at Sparrow now. I'm getting ready to go in and uh, get my chest x-ray done. And that's just one of the, uh, the the many steps that I have to take in order to get bariatric surgery. All right, so that was pretty quick and painless. Uh, she said uh, everything looked good. They're gonna be sending those results to my doctor within the next 24 hours. So yeah, done and done. What? Nothing. What were you singing? Nothing. Sing it again. No. Sing that, sing that song about the girl getting her driver's license. When she was, I got my driver's oh my God. license last week. Uh, that we always talked about. So you're gonna be thirty in how many days? That song is so. If I make it there. Angsty. Oh my God. I'm kidding. Shut up. All right, so we just had lunch. Um, we stopped off at Wendy's and we were scrolling through the menu. On she was she was looking at her Weight Watchers app. I was looking at my. Uh, my my fitness pal app and we decided to get some chili the chili there is delicious uh but it is also uh low in calories and points how many points five points for a small chili five and one for point a for chili. a light sour cream okay so six six points and I that 23 points a day she has 23 points a day so six and i haven't eaten today right because so it's that fun was, to be hangry so that was your first you know, uh, uh, so that was her first meal of the day. Six points. Uh, she must be saving up for something good for dinner. We'll find out what that is later. It's chicken throw up. Chicken throw up. Ooh, chicken throw up's really good. I'll show you guys uh, about chicken throw up. I keep looking over here for the camera that's over there. Mm -hmm. I moved it. Um, and then I had a crispy chicken sandwich. The $1.39 one It's just really small. And I also got a small chili. And oh, poop, I forgot to look at my calorie. Count on that. Well, the crispy chicken's 3.30. You remember that? Okay, 3.30. And then the chili is 2.40. What did you just say? 2.40? Yeah. Right. So that's... You do the math. Five. I'm driving. 70. 5.70. So 5.70 for lunch. Um, after not even yeah. 200, I don't think, for breakfast. Maybe it was a little bit. Maybe it was like 300 for breakfast. I'll have to look again. Not bad. I don't you remember. still have like 700 calories So left. I've still got 780, like two calories left or something like that. So not bad. Ready? And I know we weren't perfect, but I never felt this way for no one. And I just can't imagine oh God. how you Okay, stop. I didn't know you were recording. <laughs> now. Are you so sure this, we're to eat it? This is chicken throw up. We like to call it chicken throw up. As you can see, it's just chicken, some green beans, stuffing, and a couple other ingredients that we're not going to say because the kids will uh, might not eat it. What? <laughs> but that's pretty much it. It's just uh, chicken. I think it's delicious. The kids do love it, 
but uh, that's we because they, it's because they don't know the truth. Yeah, we haven't had it in a while, so huh? eat up. What's the truth? Oh my gosh, the uh, white death is upon us. Oh my gosh, my porch sounds like it's gonna cave in. It's like frozen solid. Every move I make, <laughs> feels like I'm gonna fall through my porch. Oh man, there's so much snow out here. Ah, uh, man. I know a lot of the, a lot of the country. I, I read I read last night that 40 states are under um, snow emergency. Uh, that's that's insane. I've never seen anything like this in my lifetime. Uh, so just stay safe out there, guys. Um, I'll be praying for you guys. Pray for us. Uh, hopefully, you know, we don't have uh, any power outages here in Lansing. I know we're supposed to get more snow. I mean, they're calling for like 8 to 12 inches, I think. Uh, so we already had like 4 or 5 on the ground. So this is going to be a big one. Um, all right. Well, I just wanted to recap the day. Uh, I ended with some chicken throw up. And... Uh, and it was delicious. It's essentially just um, chicken, chicken breast, uh, green beans, stuffing, uh, a little bit of sour cream. Um, what else is in there? Oh, cream of, usually you'd use cream of, uh, cream of, cream of, we use cream of mushroom tonight because we ran out of the other cream of something soup. Um, I don't remember which one I cream it. Maybe it's just cream of chicken. Uh, but anyways, you mix it all together in a crock pot, let it sit for a bit. And it just kind of looks like, looks like vomit, but it's delicious. It just tastes like, tastes like Thanksgiving. It just tastes like every, all the good stuff that you have on Thanksgiving. It's like a little bit of uh, green bean casserole with some stuffing and some chicken. And, uh, it's just good, good, uh, good food. And it was really low in calories because the, the, the chicken, it's pretty low in calories. I had about, I put that I had about six ounces. It's hard to determine what actually the ounces are um, that are on my plate. What, you know, what sort of portion do I get? So I just kind of guesstimated and uh, and I even went over on some things because um, it just didn't seem like that was enough calories for what I ate. I was just too full. And so I wound up finishing dinner with about 400 calories, which leaves me uh, no, I, I, so my dinner was about 400 calories. So that left me with about 300 calories on the day. Uh, so I'll probably have one of my veggie brownies, my double chocolate veggie brownies. Those are really good. A nice dessert. I'll warm that up and, uh, try to stay warm. Uh, I did get an email from my dietitian who was saying that she's been watching my intake on, um, my, my fitness pal. And she said that I shouldn't even be drinking decaf coffee because it still has caffeine in it and I shouldn't be having caffeine at all. So guys, I don't know what to do. Uh, even teas, like lots of teas, like the green tea that I have has caffeine in it. Everything has caffeine in it. So, so like, oh, I don't want like a cold water for breakfast or even a warm water for breakfast. Like I want, uh, what do I do? So any ideas, just let me know uh, what, you know, what I could have. I'm, I'm wondering like hot chocolate at this point i guess i don't know it doesn't have caffeine it doesn't have carbonation so maybe i should just have a cup of hot cocoa in the morning uh yeah maybe i'll actually try that that, uh, that doesn't sound bad all right i'm freezing um i love you guys have a great uh evening and just stay safe out there don't drive if you don't have to and uh tomorrow i do have to uh again i've got blood work in the morning and then i've got a doctor's appointment i got my way in uh, tomorrow afternoon around two o'clock. So I'll be uh, filling in on that tomorrow. So have a great night. God bless you guys. Do something kind for somebody out there. Uh, not because you want something in return, just because it's the right thing to do. All right. Talk to you later, guys. God bless you. Bye-bye.